morning plumbers as you know we do everything plumbing the good the bad and the ugly all while training my two sons I got the young one with me today what's your name God <laughs> God and for this next adventure with a special guest appearance of Angelo Barron special guest you're still in school you're you're supposed to be in school today <laughs> we are going to take out some radiators that froze and broke put an air test on a heat system to make sure nothing else is broken do you have anything today? I'm going to try to celebrate spring break the way it was meant to be celebrated and how's that? working hard working that's what we want to hear hard work pays off no nights my man 9 o'clock bedtime he who hoots with the owls does not soar with the eagles in the morning. I just want to tell you that. We will see you at the job. We're on location and we have a handful of radiators that we have to remove and cap to test the rest of the system. Like you see here, we had a freeze up and we're going to test it to see if it's totally shot, giving the owner the benefit of the doubt. And this big boy over here is also broken. We definitely had a trail of water that they already cleaned up. And you can see some splatters. These are splatters from across the room when the radiator actually exploded. And we believe this one's good. And I believe this one's done too. So that's three, and the fourth is in a spot that isn't so nice. So we gotta pull out the range, pull this one out. They don't think the heat system went, but we're gonna double check it, test it with air. And I have a special guest today coming, off from school, 63180, AB. And he's not here yet. Good morning. Good morning. Are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> Are you ready for what? We're ball we're balling in pipes today, not the court. Here's what happened here. This place froze up. So as you see we got broken radiators, right? Yeah. So with this one here, we're gonna move this range and disconnect this one. We're gonna test the system. Alright, good news. We got the lines capped off. I didn't get the shots. I apologize. Too much going on. The kitchen. The bathroom. And the bedroom are all capped off. And the radiator valve actually held. So now what we're going to do, this thing's shot. So we're going to take this apart. And we have everything capped and tested. And upstairs, we got to make sure, so we have it under pressure with air, make sure we got no secret leaks. Oh, here's a radiator. Okay. And these are all holding. They're holding there. It's 30 pounds of pressure on it right now. And here we got one in the bathroom. She's holding and all the heat lines so far are holding in the system. We still need to fire. This end, I'll study this end if you can just grab that and because that's gonna pop out of the nipple. <laughs> okay. You gotta cut that all the way 
through. This, this thing cut all the way through. It probably got to be cut too. Mm -hmm. How about your chisel, hammer and chisel? We can try right it. Right here, boom. I think it'll pop. I love sledgehammer. Mm -hmm. All right, you. You, just tap. You, you want to do a tapping so it's all loses piece over here? Yep. There you go. It should pop out. He went to get that. Okay. I'll lean this right over here. We'll just do the next one, right? One here, boom. Okay. Sounds like a plan. Alright, cool. That is it, in a nutshell. Okay, as we're taking out the radiators, the gauge is holding strong at 30. We're gonna make sure nothing's leaking under here. We have everything on air pressure right now, and everything sounds good, looks good. Feels good. Oh, uh, you can see where the water all ran out, Chris. What's that? All the water. What about? Oh, there's a big, a big drainage trench in here, <laughs> going right out the front. Yep, right out the front, out to where the, the new water main was put in. Okay. Yeah. Nice. How about that? Right back there is the heater room where a piece of plywood and gas tire is. See the yellow pipe coming out, so. Everything's holding. Just don't let that thing flip. You're doing fine. Here, go forward. Don't go backwards. Like a glove. Yeah. Just give me some wheels. 
we can slide up just a little bit more this corner. If you come on there more, there you go. Someone come up and hold me like this. Yeah, maybe I should lay it down. Do all on the inside. Yeah. Do all on the outside. The paint must have held them together. What do you got to say for yourself? Nothing. I said we should have carried them. Save, save me some gas. Carried them. <laughs> yeah. These young bucks. We got to save some for tomorrow. We're doing a sewer tomorrow. I won't make it. He's gonna make it. Don't bite your nails with the first job. That's right. We cleaned up the mess, put the range back. The gauge is still holding at 30. Everything, everything is holding right now. So with that, we're gonna lock this place up, call the owner, let them know what's going on, and get that pile of trash out of here. Next place for them is the junkyard. Roll the window down before I smack you. Did we get her done? Yeah, I got her done. Did we get her done? <laughs> yeah. Now what? It's not time to go home. We're just That's starting. Break, it's spring break. Nah, spring work. Back at the radiator job. Waiting for the scrap god to come pick up this metal. Scrap god and scrap goddess. Local legends. Tucker Fupper. YouTube sensation and his bride, the scrap goddess. Check them out. Hey, God, I would back right up so we get this little bit of help right here. Hi, guys. scrap goddess. This is a famous. These are famous YouTube scrappers. <laughs> so if you guys don't know about it, you gotta check out his channel. Yeah, you gotta check it out. Upper Tucker. What's your channel? Tucker dude? Chuck Barron, plumbing okay. extraordinaire. I'll link it to you too. I just did yours already. What are you claiming today? Trying like, to make an honest dollar. That's hard out here that dude. I know. They always try and keep the man down. They are. Yeah. Well this is the biggest one. We'll do this one first. Did you remember the memory I posted on Instagram? Not that long ago? It was like two years ago and you were cutting the thing. Oh! <laughs> I think I did see it, right? That was gold, right? That guy. That guy ended up getting me good. <laughs> that guy? Or the job? The job. <laughs> the going shit, right? Yeah. <laughs> you know? Daddy's little help is sketchy. Yeah. 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 Right to me. Put it right on that. 
be honest, it wasn't even worth it at the end. I had to make sure they didn't want them, you know what I mean? Or I would have had them come over this morning. Yeah. Well, like, some people have scrapped their own stuff, you know. Until they get there. Yeah. Until they're putting it they, in, yeah. in their trunk. <laughs> and then they get to the scrap yard and they wish they never did it. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean, though? <laughs> like, what's it, what's it actually saying? Though? This is probably eight cents a pound. Like a bunch of like a mystery <laughs> box of like unclaimed oh, packages. I saw it. It was crazy. <laughs> we got smacked. <laughs> Wait, there was a fucking there was a laptop in there. A Mac. MacBook. Uh huh. It doesn't work. Didn't like they just work. fucking smacked us. We like, had like we got like a bunch of ugly ass bridal dresses and like ugly ass shoes from like India. <laughs> it was so funny. Yeah. Terrible. We sold uh we got a, we sold one thing for a hundred today though. Yeah, some like virtual we'll reality video game thing. It's like that show. Yeah, it's insane. The Locker Show. Yeah. Remember, uh... The Storage Wars. Storage Wars, yeah. Yeah, uh... Those guys still yup. make... <laughs> yup! Those guys still make content, though. Some yeah. of them do YouTube now. Oh, really? Yeah. Like, they make making more money. <laughs> yeah. That's funny. Yeah. Uh, you know, it's weird, though, because like, you would think they get, like, a lot of views. Yeah, they do. Like, they get, like, a lot so much to do. How can you be, like, you can't be talking to strangers. <laughs> <laughs> so you say? But then you find the motherfuckers that do. That you talk to, though? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're right, though. No one wants to acknowledge it. Nah. <laughs> Who's that time I even go out? You know? By the time, get, by the time I get up at 3 to edit, go to three, work at 3 a.m.? <laughs> you're fucked. That's uh, fucking crazy. I get up at crazy. 6 every morning. I, get up I thought four. I was crazy. 4. 4 is my clock. It's nice waking up that early, though, because it's like you have the world to yourself for a second. Yeah. Why not? It's seven. No, thank you, man. Now we get someone. Now we get the. Am I your dad? <laughs> Not today. <laughs> Where's our dad? Fozzie's our dad. How's the GoPro here? Or I mean the session. It's nice. Scrap God and scrap goddess. Thank you for picking up this scrap. <laughs>